DPP 1, uh, question number 19, we are going with. A uniform rope, please listen carefully. Please go through the question carefully. 19th question, more than one choice. Sir. A uniform rope of linear mass density lambda. Linear mass density ka matlab kya hai? What is the meaning of linear mass density? Mass upon total length. If you take a string of mass 1 kg, otherwise 2 kg, 4 meter. How many meter? 4 meter. 4 meter rope is 2 kg. So, linear mass density lambda means what? Mass upon total length. Mass is how many kg? 2 kg. Length is? 4 meter. So, what you will get? 1 upon 2 kg per meter. This is linear mass density. We call it as linear mass density. What the point? It is uniform. Means, he said uniform now in the question. Uniform means mass is equally distributed in the row. Every point if you take 1 cm in that 1 cm the mass distribution is same. Arbitrarily you choose, you choose one point in the row. In the given 1 cm length the mass distribution will be same. Okay? That is lambda constant. You should understand that. Okay? A uniform rope of linear mass density lambda is placed inside a fixed curved tube in vertical plane as shown in the figure. The rope is stationary. The rope is stationary. Find the normal reaction on the rope by the tube. Find the normal reaction on the rope by the tube. You see, I gave the question in this way. Right? There is a tube like this. In this tube, there is a rope. Actually, the rope is in this shape, exactly fitted into this tube. Exactly fitted into this tube. Okay? Clear. This is what length he gave? V. V. What is this height? H. H. This is the situation. Total rope is in this. Okay? Total rope in this. Like this, the rope is. This is a tube. In the tube, exactly the rope is fitted. Okay? And the rope is not coming out. With respect to inertial observer, the rope is at rest. If, if the tube is smooth, if there is no friction between tube and rope, the rope will come out, obviously. The rope is not coming out means you are going to expect some other force. Okay? We are least bothered of that, but just I am explaining this. Okay? This rope inside this tube is not coming out. It is stationary with respect to an inertial observer. This is the condition he gave now. Is it clear or not? Okay? What he is asking to find? Find the normal reaction on the rope by the tube. This rope is in touch with what? Tube. The rope is in touch with tube. You observe carefully, magnified view I will give. This is a, some portion I am taking and I am giving the magnified view. This is the rope you see inside this. Rope. Rope is there inside. Exactly it fitted into tube. So the tube will exert contact force on it or not? Yes. Yes. He is asking that only. What is asking? Yes. Find the normal reaction on the rope by the tube. Tube will exert. Rope is in touch with the tube. This rope is inside the tube. Clear? You are able to understand. So, now this tube is going to exert contact force on this normal contact force. So, what is the total normal contact force on this rope? But exerted by the tube. This is the question. Okay, beta? Right. Now, we understood the situation. So, can I go with my mathematical analysis over that? Okay. Now, <coughs> lambda he gave. How much? Linear mass density. In the question what he gave is, in the question what he gave is, some arbitrary shapes. Sure? Right. What is this length? B. This length is B. What is this height? H. Yes. Okay. Now, lambda is mass upon total mass upon total length. We know this. For this, I am taking some small portion here <coughs> of length dl. What are? Length dl. Okay? Clear. 
differential length. Differential length means what? Very, very small, but not equal to zero. zero. Infinitesimally small length. A differential part of the what this rope I'm taking. That is dm. Its mass is what? Dm. Now can you say what is dm now? dm is nothing but you see for total mass length is L. For length total L mass is M. For total length L mass is M. For DL length, how much mass will be there? DL into M upon L. Your commercial mathematics, business mathematics, one dairy will cost 5 rupees, two dairy will cost 10 rupees. In the same way I did. So DL times M upon L. What is M upon L? Lambda. So lambda DL is nothing but mass of the DL length. That is nothing but DM. The mass of DL length I am taking as DM. How much I got mass of DL length? Lambda into DM. That is nothing but DM. DM. You are able to understand. Is it clear or not? Yes. Now, you see, you draw a tangent here, it will subtend angle theta here, it will subtend angle theta. theta, okay. Now you can consider this as an inclined plane and this as mass dm, mass dm on inclined plane. So what happens to this? This is dm, what is this? dm. dm. At the contact force on the differential mass is dn, very small dn. I need what dn na? n, n, complete n on the string. I took differential n, this is dn. What is my dm g? What is this? Can you say? dm g cos dm g sin theta. Sin theta, very good. Now for an inertial observer, what he feels, this dm has no motion in this direction. Means per Newton's law, S, second law, dn is equal to dmg. It is analogy with what case? An inclined plane of theta, m mass is kept, that is dm. This is dmg. This is what? dm. Okay, this is what? dmg sin theta. This is what? dmg cos theta. Cos theta. This is equal to dmg cos of dm. What is dmg sin theta is balanced by some other force. It may be friction or whatever it may be. He's not, he has not provided that u uh, is smooth. Means his intention is that. Okay? Right. Now dmg cos theta. dm is nothing but dmg cos theta. dm times g cos theta. Now, we need n. We need n means we should integrate on both sides. We need n. n is nothing but integration of dm. Is nothing but integration of dmg cos theta. What is dm beta? dm is nothing but lambda into dm. Lambda into dm. G cos theta. Now I can write this as integral. Okay. Lambda g ko baha nikal Yes, I can remove it from the integral. Because lambda and g are constant. Yes. But theta is varying from place to place. Yes, real. This is the differential length. So I can remove what from the integral? Lambda g integral dl cos theta. Integral dl cos theta. Can I? Sure. So I got n as lambda g integral dl cos theta. Okay. But in the options he has not given this option. Yes. Okay. He gave something in terms of A and B because uh, B, lambda and H are the given terms. G is also given term. So we should get answer in terms of B, lambda, H and G. So we are supposed to eliminate lambda, DLN, cos theta. So for that, I am taking the magnified view of this. This length is what I took? DL now. This length is what I took? DL. Yes, this length is DL. This will become what? dx along x-axis. This is my x-axis. This is my y-axis. X-axis, y-axis. This is dl of the rope means this will become dx. This will become dy. I have drawn tangent from here. This is theta. Then this also will become theta. Then cos theta is nothing but dx upon dl. So dx is uh, nothing but dl 
cos theta. theta. From this, what I can write here? Yes. DL yes. cos theta means what I can write? DS. Yes. Okay. So n is equals to lambda g integral dx. X value varies from where to where? This is x is equal to 0. This is x is equal to b. x is equal to 0. I am taking origin here. I am taking here as origin. This is x is equal to 0. This is x is equal to b. So limit varies from 0 to b. So what you get? Lambda g x 0 to b. So lambda g b. This is what? Total contact force exerted by the cube on the string. Is it clear or not? First, we took differential part and we analyzed the differential parts and we got a relation of dn. We need n. We need n means we should integrate on both sides. Okay? If we integrate, we get integrate dn, we are going to get n. I integrated and I got this relation. I eliminated dl cos theta, I replaced dl cos theta with dx by this analysis. A magnified view of this small element. Okay? So, dx is dl cos theta. Means dl cos theta, ko kya, kya kar sakte hain? I can replace dl cos theta with dx. Yes. And I apply integral. Because x value varies from, I consider this as origin, this as x is equal to b. This is my x axis, this is my y axis. x is equal to 0 to b, x limits. So, 0 to b. I applied that before lambda gb. So what are the options here? Lambda gb is one of the options. Non-zero is there. So what are the options here? Yeah. Lambda gb is one answer. Non-zero is other answer. So the total contact force by the cube on the rope is non-zero is one answer. Minus non-zero is one answer and lambda gb is one answer. This is more than one choice type question. Understood? Thank you.